Welcome to another episode of GPS Myths and today we're going to talk about the two most popular GPS myths out there. If we wrap a GPS in tin foil, you won't be able to see it. People think they can thwart the system like that. The second way is to have an aluminum clipboard. They ask, what happens if somebody just rests an aluminum clipboard over top of the device? Is it going to communicate? So I'm Russ with GPS Myths and have a look here. We're going to show you whether that's true or not on this episode of GPS Myths. Hi, it's Russ here at gps to go I love this one. This is one of my favorite myths that we've ever done. This is the idea that one of our compact GPS trackers can be thwarted and you won't be able to see it if you wrap it inside a tin foil. So what I'm going to do here is we have one of our GPS's I'm going to double and then quadruple the tin foil. And what we're going to do is we're going to wrap this up really good and tight and put even a big glob of it around the bottom. Okay, so you can see all that. And then what we're going to do is plug it into the GPS to go truck and see whether or not we can still clearly see where it is on the internet. So let's go and do that. All right, so once again, we've got ourselves our Go5 device ending in six ticks to Bravo. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it, we've got some double layered aluminum foil here and I'm going to wrap it really well and so that's now wrapped up and let's go over and I'm going to put it inside the car. Alright so now we're here at the GPS to go truck and we're going to plug this in. So. Here we go, plugging GPS tracking into the GPS to go truck with tin foil wrapped around it in five, four, three, two, one. And there's our beeps to see it booting up. All right, so the next thing we'll do is we're gonna go and look at it on the internet. Doing some driving here in our beats. Something else that's important, by the way, that uh, I'd like to mention is people that are using one of our Go5 compacts, when you're separating it from either a cable or from the OBD2 port of a vehicle, don't yank it by grabbing. Grab it, what I like to call, around the shoulders and wiggle it apart so as not to separate the case. So that's a good helpful hint. So we're doing some driving. We're here in our beats. Alright, the second part of this myth, which is very, very popular, and people are always talking about this, is again, one of our GPS trackers and an aluminum clipboard. So people often say, well, what if one of my guys just lays their aluminum clipboard over top of this all day? They're going to be invisible. We won't be able to see them. So what we're going to do, and just follow me in here, is we're going to hook this up to one of our easy connect harnesses and then we're going to drive around with the clipboard covering it and we'll see what kind of reception we're getting as well. All right, let's have a look. So the easy thing to do is we've got our GPS. There we go. And we're going to place that up on the dash. I'm going to cover it with our big handy dandy aluminum clipboard. And then we'll go out for a drive and see if we're still getting reception. Alright, so we're out on the road and now we've got our GPS and it's covered by the aluminum clipboard. And we're going to be able to take a ride around the block 
and see what kind of results we're getting. Oh, we're still booting up. Something else that's important, by the way, that uh, I'd like to mention is people that are using one of our Go5 contacts, when you're separating it from either a cable or from the OBD2 port of a vehicle, don't yank it by grabbing. Grab it what I like to call around the shoulders and wiggle it apart so as not to separate the case. So that's a good helpful hint. Doing some driving here in our beats. Okay, so we're back in the office for part number two. Uh, this part of the myth, of course, we're back here talking about the aluminum clipboard covering one of our Go 5, Go 6 GPS models. So we can see here we've got our complete breadcrumb trail as before. If I mouse over any part of our breadcrumb trail, I can see here on the second trip every square inch of what we did and we can see all of the different times of what we went around the block. We did this twice in the uh, second part. So we're every, able to see every square inch of what that vehicle did even though the GPS was completely covered over with an aluminum clipboard. <laughs> 